Hey guys, welcome back to Atlas. This is Survival Bob, my, my Let's Play episode number three, season two. We are on board the Salty Bob here with uh, old Monkey Bob. Got a lot of Bobs, a lot of Bobs on the boat. And uh, today I think we're going to do some taming. I've got the itch to tame some creatures. I leveled up over, uh, I was running around at night. I don't like to record at night if I can help it. And I was running around and I leveled up and I think I got the skills to go taming tier 2. So, we're going to try to tame some tier 2 stuff before we head out. Uh, as you can probably tell, I, I have been working on my boat a little bit. I uh, I don't love it, but it is what it is. So, uh, I put a little chair here so we can you know have a seat. Maybe we'll do a little fishing while we sail. So, make sure I don't fall off. Might need to back that chair up a little bit. But I'll just show you around the boat real quick, and then we'll jump over to some taming. Um, I, I do want to show you this, so if you, I don't know if you can see that or not. So I put the wooden ladders on. I could build a loom and build rope ladders, which look nicer. But the reality is, um, I don't think I'm going to do rope ladders this season. I did last season, and they will retract uh, if you push the right button, or the wrong button in my case. And you can end up off your boat without a ladder down, so... Yeah, uh, they not, may not look as good, but they definitely don't retract. So that's good. So the wood ladders, uh, survival bob approved. Now we had to put the smithy down. That's what that basket is. I, I put a little platform here. I put a little doorway here. Put a bed down. Uh, nothing else changed. Oh, I extended the the uh, walkway all the way to the end, and then closed this in. And then I put a platform up here because we're gonna be doing some um, uh, loot fishing basically we're gonna take our grappling hook which I built let me show you grappling hook goes right there get this stuff out of my inventory real quick so got the grappling hook so we'll be able to use that to uh, try to grab some treasure as we see there'll be floatsome or just treasure chests kind of floating in the water so we'll grab that early game it's a good way to get some money and some uh, food and resources but uh, yeah so this is it nothing spectacular I did have to put a ladder off the back of this because the rope ladder I just smacked your head into there which is not really helpful but now I don't have the, the issue that I was having before so there we go salty Bob ready for action I about got her loaded up as well so what I want to tame first and I think I said I wasn't gonna do this but I changed my mind. I think I'm gonna get a cat. I feel like we need a mascot. The monkey's good, but the cat just kind of sits around, and I like that. What is that bird just chilling over there? All right, so I'm looking for cats before they aggro and run off. And if you've never tamed a cat, I'll show you kind of how I do it. What is that bird doing? Alright, I see some down there. Are there any in the walls of the city? Because that's a little easier. Hmm. Alright, let's just go get that one. You look like my cat. Oh my god. Yeah, see, they aggro way farther away. Let me see. Let me run around here. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Nope. So, bud, this is a commodities vendor. I don't think I showed him off the other day. You can trade for different resources with him uh, or buy different resources for money with him. Did all the cats run off? Are they scattered all over the island now? Well, dang it. So, we might not be taming a cat first. We'll wait till we come across one. Because they are much easier in the uh, village. What is this bird doing? See, look, they're way down there. We got a chance to use our spyglass, though. Let's, let's check this out. Spy cave cat. What level are you? 72. What level is that? 68? Yeah, let's go get a cat. Alright, so to get a cat, you basically... You gotta sneak up on them. And by sneak up, I mean lay down. So let me get over there. Ugh. Sneaking through the bushes. 
in hunt of our perfect cat. Or any cat. I don't really care at this point. I thought there was one over here. Yeah, there's one right there. Can't tell which one's closer. Let's just go kind of in the middle and see what happens. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Are you coming to me? Come here. Alright, come here. Here, kitty, kitty. That's it. Stay. Alright, let me get into uh, serious mode. Put that away. Hey, kitty, kitty. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Alright, so you put fish in your last slot, and uh, that's the taming food for cat. Makes sense, right? Come here, kitty. We got a wild male cat. Level 68. So he's not even bothered by me. I noticed in town. Ooh, look at that coloring. That's pretty sweet. Nine seconds, eight seconds. All right, this is going to take a minute. I noticed in town that when they jumped, uh, if I laid down immediately, they would just hold. They would just stop. They would just de-aggro. There you go, kitty. 30 seconds. Yeah, this takes a while. And I've got my taming bumped way up, so if you're playing on um, official, be ready to spend the afternoon on this. 19 seconds. Hey, kitty. So, unlike the monkey, apparently, if you get right up on them, they don't care if you're laying down. Alright, seven. Come on. Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Three. Want some more fish? There you go. Alright, so we're about halfway done. Alright, this should be the final feed if I can get him. Come here, kitty. Come, come here. Come here. Alright. Um. Tom. Can't think of a better name for a cat. It's a male. Come on, Tom. Right. Stand up. So let's access your inventory. You need some fish, don't you? There you go. Have some fish. Dang, it, it used a lot. So guys, I, I cut there, but um, I chased this stupid cat around for a couple minutes. Easy. Um, they walk, they amble, whatever you want to call it, faster than you do. So uh, if you're straight line behind him, he's just going to get away from you. But I got Tom level 101. Now, with the cat, you can do some stuff. So they can go hunting for you. So, if we put them on hunting, it's disabled. we can disable it. Hunt for rodents. Hunt for fish. Let's go hunt for fish. So, hunting. Yeah, okay. So, he's doing the hunting for fish. So, th that little animation is him hunting. He doesn't, like, run away. He just kind of does that for a while, and then eventually it tells you that he's done. I'm trying to do third person here. All right. So, taming uh, taming tier two. I kept saying level one yesterday, or last episode. Um, what I meant was tier one. We're on tier two now, so we can get cats. We can get pigs. I think we can get bears, too. Is that a bear over there, or is that a pig? I saw something. I saw something big walking through the bush. We'll go check it out. So, um, I, I don't know if I, I don't think I have to stay there. Are you going to come with me? Is that going to mess you up? Yeah, it kind of messed him up. So I guess I have to leave him there. What level are you, pig? So we can tame the pig. If we put berries in our slot, we can tame a pig. We're going to tame a lot of pigs. We're not going to tame this one because, honestly, I don't, I don't need to right now. So I'm going to let him hunt for a second. And when he gets back, I will bring you back and show you what he got. All right, so Tom, um, I don't know. I'm going to have to work on the hunting or my patience or both. I sat there with him for three or four minutes, and he just kind of crouched around and didn't do anything. Get out of here, pig. So, Tom, let's put you on the boat. Come on. So they run everywhere when they're freaked out, but when you're running, they just like, meh, I'll get there when I get there. 
It's kind of how cats roll, isn't it? Let's see if they like uh, water. So the cool thing about this game, if you don't know already, is um, the animals will just get on the boat. You can place them on the boat if you're lucky and you get in the right spot. Move on to Salty Bob's Ring Shackle Sloop. So, bam. There we go. What the heck? Oh, was that because he was still on follow? He must have jumped off the boat. Alright, so he should appear on the boat somewhere. Where are you at? There's some poop here. What are you doing? Alright, I'll save him. Monkey Bob, you watch the boat. Everybody stop following Bob for a minute. I gotta save the cat. He's in the water. I got gotcha. you. Alright, so the cat will <laughs> grab you, sit on you as well. He does not like being in the water. Alright, I'm coming. You see how his feet freak out when you get when you get in the water, but then he just calms down. So, uh, we got the cat. Let's take a look at that on the shoulder. I don't know that that's the most comfortable. I've had cats on me like not like that, but they dig their claws in. Kind of hurts. Don't. So there's a buff there, and honestly, I don't know what it is. I'm gonna have to look into it. Um, I, I don't even know what that's a picture of. I can't even tell. So if you know what that buff is for the cat, let me know down in the comments below. I'd love to hear it. All right. So you stay. I'm gonna whistle stop. All right, cat. Tom, you're in charge of the boat. Me and Monkey Bob are going to go out and see what else we can tame. So, on the boat, if you notice, um, let me show you this. you got to pay attention to what you have. So, the weight, we're about max weight. We can't do a whole lot more. But as soon as we get out into the ocean, we'll be able to level up the weight. Uh, so, I'm not super worried. And I'll, I'll get rid of some stuff probably before we go as well. But, uh, down here it says uh, ship crew 2 of 5. So, it counts me and it counts the cat. It's not counting the monkey because the monkey's on my shoulder, but if I throw the monkey off my shoulder and I go back here, you see the ship's crew is three of five. So, uh, if you have more than five or whatever the... I thought that was a chicken out there. That's a seagull swimming around a, a, a piece of poop right there. You have fun with that seagull. But anyway, if you, uh, if you have more than the number of crew on your ship, whether it's animals or people, then it's going to start sinking. And that's, that's never good, right? Ah, oh, crap. Missed. Stupid sign. Here, let me, there we go. Come on, let me up. Let me up. Please. Let me up. There we go. Whew. So, I, I do want to take some animals with me. We're not taking any people crew with me, so I got room for a little bit more on my boat. We'll see what we can find. I'm tempted to tame a bear, guys, but I don't know if I'm ready for that yet. I just hate to get somewhere and not have bears and have missed out on my shot, right? What level is this pig? If I find a high-level pig like that level 100 I saw the other day, I'm definitely going to tame it. All right, what level are you? 12. Let me go ahead and get some berries in my inventory. And let's see what we can see. Hey, cat. And you can just see the cats because the aggro bar shows up. We're going to run around the island. I'm going to grab... Um, hey, Henrietta. You're coming with us, too. So we got me... We've got one shoulder pet, so we've got two crew. So you'll make three crew. So we got room for maybe one. I'm going to go one more. I don't want to accidentally throw the monkey off the sh off my shoulder and um, start sinking the boat, which I have done before. Luckily, I remembered to pick it back up, and we were fine. So let's run around real quick, see what we see. What do I have on me as far as... Well, I can't tame a bear. I don't even have a bola. I haven't made a tannery. So let's just look for a pig. Let's grab a few maps. Uh see what we see we're gonna be uh on a journey for a while so we'll be stopping at islands along the way maybe we can find some maps so these are treasure maps common treasure map is an l7 so you kind of see that 
the treasure maps will take you to a spot if you don't know already that uh, it's got buried treasure, obviously, but they are guarded by an army of the damned, so dead stuff will pop up out of the ground and eat your face and uh, shoot you and beat you, and then right when you're about to win, they'll go back into the ground and heal themselves and then come back up again fully healed and start eating your face again. So, you want to be prepared for that. Not saying we can't do it, but we definitely want to be prepared. I'm going to try to grab what seeds I can so I can get a little garden going. I got nine rice seeds. I don't need near that much rice, but I'm just going to kind of grab what I can as we make our journey around the little starter island and bring all the resources we need, we can with us. What level are you? 36? Nope. Not interested. Only high level pigs for me. Thank you. What was that? Seagull got mad about something. Alright, so I'm looking for fruits, vegetables, anything with seeds basically that uh, I may not find other places, and then a high level pig. Level 12, you're crap. I might as well kill some of these while I'm at it just to kind of level up. Come here. Ow! You're dead. Oh god. Uh, I got distracted when my level up happened and I thought I killed him, but he was not dead. But you dead now. Thank you for the level. As I said in the first episode, the, from my experience, the quickest way to level up early game is to just kill stuff. You seem to get more, um, more XP from dealing damage than you do from other things. So I got my weight is almost to 400. Why can't I, why can't I go over there? There we go. Is that going to get me there? All right. So what do we need? Don't need breeding. These would be useful, but I don't need them right now. Let's see, tool studies is really not till I start getting upgraded weapons. Repair is going to be good. What do I need? Crafting speed, metallurgy. We're going to need that pretty soon, but not yet. Armory. Hmm. Melee weapons. Hmm. Maybe I should go straight to metallurgy so that I can learn that. I'm not going to be, I'm not doing a forge here for a little bit. I don't need that. That's more of a luxury seamanship. Let's go ahead. Let's get a sextant. Um, let's get that so we can see floats them from further away. That's good. Uh, improves the amount of time available. We'll do that. Navigators, not worried about that. Captain Earring, eh, I don't really have a crew yet, so I'm not super worried about that. Uh, let's go back here, let's see if I'm, we already looked here, let's go back to the, what is this one, survivalism? Okay, let's get our slimming speed going, because that was crap. Um, unlock medicine. We'll unlock cooking and farming so that'll give us does that no it doesn't give us anything yet it just unlocks it so all right what level are you piggy Ooh, level 40 but you're in love who are you in love with level 72 yes please all right so i'm gonna follow this guy male pig yeah i'm gonna follow this guy around and um stuff berries in him till he wants to come home with me and be my friend and uh, the sun is going down in the distance, so I will bring you guys back once I'm done and into something else. Alright, this should be the last feed here. We got a pig. And what do you name a pig? Your first pig is going to be Snossage. Snoss. Nope. Hey, you gotta spell it right. Snossage. I don't know if that's right, but that's what we're going with. You are Snossage, my first male pig, level 107. Let's check your stats. Let's see. Health 341, decent. Melee damage 225, also decent. Stamina 750. All right, all right. Uh, what's your weight? 235. Eh, it's kind of meh. I'm okay with it though. I like it. So it's dark. Let's get some light going. 
Now the pigs, you can ride without a saddle. So I'm way too heavy to ride Snossage because I weigh more than 235 with all my weight. What am I at? Oh, I'm at 215. Let's chunk that. We don't need that. We don't need that. How we doing, Snossage? You need some food? Have some berries? Put those down here. Let's see. Can we go now? A little bit? Yeah, a little bit. Look at him. So the pigs, you can use them to harvest berries. That's about it. And whack stuff. Um, but, man, they go slow if you have... I can I can drop this. I can always get more of that. I can get more wood too. There's trees everywhere. All right. Let's look for something to whack. Oh, snossage defecated. Thanks for the message there, Atlas. I appreciate that. Snossage. I hate that I'm so heavy because they are so much more fun when they run. I'm looking for something for Snossage to fight so we can see what kind of damage he does. Alright guys, let me run around slowly with this guy and I'll bring you back in just a sec. Alright, I think we found a volunteer for our test. We've got a wild chicken. And we've got a male turtle. Let's get crazy. Come on Snossage, let's see what you can do. Start with a chicken. Bam! Suck it, chicken! 18! That's pretty good! I'll take it! Run! You got to poop again, didn't you? Alright, so the chicken... Um, now, the, the downside about killing everything on your tames is you're not getting a, much XP at all for that, if any. I don't know that you get any. But, um, you definitely kill stuff quicker. And at less risk to your own life. Now, we can get off a of Snossage, and he's going to attack the turtle as soon as the turtle tries to hit him. Get him, Snossage. So we don't have to be involved in this whole escapade. He can do it himself. Alright, good job, Snossage. Alright, turtle. Where'd you... Hey, where are you? Alright, there you are. Give me your stuff. Give me your bits. So, uh... Snossage, good test. 18... Damage is decent for, uh, it's decent. I like it. You know, I'd like to see 20 or more than that. But, you know, 18's pretty good. We'll level you up. It'll be fine. You want to carry some stuff for me? Mm -hmm. I don't need all that meat. Eh, you're fine. All right, let's go. We're going to keep running around the island. I'll bring you guys back here in a minute. All right, guys, uh, we are packing up. We've got everything out of here. And we've got everything out of here. Except for the coal, which I don't really need right now. Henrietta, you come follow. We'll see how this works out. And uh, Snossage, come on. Let's go. I'm not sure who's slower, the monkey or the chicken. So we'll find out. We'll just run, put these guys on the boat. And uh, if Henrietta doesn't make it, we'll come find her. And if we can't find her, we'll just leave her. I'm just kidding, Henrietta. We wouldn't do that. Probably. Maybe. We might. Depends. So we got a monkey. We got a pig. We got some seeds. We got some bean seeds and rice seeds. I did grab some maps, too. I was running around at night. And I got uh, some maps. We got... Let's see. What do we got here? M7. L7. K7. M7. And M7. So we got three and M7, which I think is where we're at, isn't it? Let's see. Is that where we're at? Yeah, we are in M7. But I don't think we're ready for uh, pirates yet. We could definitely tame up some more pigs and build a little piggy army and go get the uh, get the treasure. Where's the chicken? I don't even see it. Who knows? All right, come on. coming Snossage is coming Snossage is a good boy come on Snossage you don't you get stuck after I said that 
Come on. Come on. Come what uh and he's in the water. Alright, Snossage. Come on over here. <laughs> so usually there he is. Good job. Alright, so you stop. And we'll move we'll position you very slowly right up here. Let's check the weight on the boat. Let's see. Uh yeah, we're overweight. Crap. Alright, so we gotta get rid of Snossage. Might be you. Come on. Are you following me? You might be guarding the base with uh, old Henrietta there. Come on. Let me up. Eh. Snossage, are you trying to drown me? Just because I'm not going to take you with me? Let me up. Um, am I trying to drown you? Alright guys, let me get this sorted out. I will be right back. I'll be back, I promise. You got anything I want? Yes, I need that wood. Thank you. And then you can have some more berries. Alright. So, good luck to you, Snossage. But anyway, that's how you tame a pig. What you do with it after that can be a challenge at the beginning. Alright dude, we're heading out. We will see you later. Thank you for the boat. It was an excellent deal for Bob. So, alright, we got our cat, we got our monkey, we lost our chicken, and our pig is gonna... You, Snossage, you look for Henrietta. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Alright, how are we doing on weight now? Eh, a little better. What do I have? Is there something I can drop? Um, I can drop that. I can drop that. As soon as we get going, though, we should level up relatively quickly. Is there any... Ooh, I don't really have any wood. Fiber. We got a decent amount of metal, so that's good. For this, I got a lot of hide. That's that's part of my weight issue there is all this hide I got. But we need hide. We've got hide. We got some seeds. I don't need that. We'll take the stone. Put that keratin over there. Oh, it's raining. I need to learn rain barrel. Do I know rain barrel? I do not know rain barrel. Um, I think I put something in my... Where is it? Yeah, the um, mortar and pestle. Guys, we didn't look at this last time, but mortar and pestle, we, we put it down. What you need here is cementing paste or organic paste, whatever they call it. Yeah. So we're going to make that. That'll lighten us up some because the weight of the sap is ridiculous. See that? It's 20 pounds, and as we turn it into paste, it goes down to nothing. So that'll save us 20 or 30 pounds there just on that and get us some pace, so we'll go ahead and get that going. Let me see if there's anything else. I do not want to leave in a rainstorm. Whoa, kitty, don't get washed away. Because there are cyclones out there, and uh, old Bob, Bob's not a big fan of the cyclone. So I'm going to wait this rainstorm out, and then we will hit the ocean, hit the high seas for adventure. Go grab that part of the map over there while I'm waiting for the rain. Oh guys, there's a ton of maps out here. When it's dark, uh, at nighttime, or in the rain, you can really find the treasure maps a lot easier. Just look at them. They're everywhere. 
was running around before and only found a couple. So, um... I'm going to pick all these up. I don't know that we're going to do a treasure in the next episode or two. We might. It just depends on where we end up. Uh, what I want to do is I want to go to a certain part of the map. And uh, I'll kind of show you what I'm thinking. But uh, as we go there, we're going to stop along the way. We're going to get the discoveries. Uh, discoveries are important. It helps you level up. I do not have XP increased on this, so I'm just getting the normal level of experience. So uh, I'll, while I do have uh, sped up gathering and sped up um, taming, uh, I do not have sped up XP. So I got to get that the way that we get it. So I think on my last episode, or my last series, I only got to level 51, 52, 53, somewhere in there. So I wasn't super high level, but I was able to do about everything I needed to cool thing about this game, the devs uh, made it so you can respec, meaning if you don't like what what you got, you can redo it. Um, if you don't like the way you put your points in, you can redo them easily. You just gotta go buy some little memory wipe potion from one of the guys there in the, uh, in the free port, and you're good to go. So, we're probably going to stop along the way. We'll, we'll definitely stop. We're not going to go all the way to where I want to go in a sloop because that would be horrible. So we're going to stop at an island not too far away probably and build a little starter base, get a, uh, a better ship or two, and then we'll gather some resources, tame some more stuff, and then we'll make our journey. Is that? Did these just reappear or did I just miss them? We're getting maps like crazy. All of these have been in the sevens, I think. I'm pretty sure. Uh, nope. Monkey, come back. Come back, monkey. Like, no, oh, because I'm I'm tired. Come here, monkey. Come back to me. If you double tap Y on Xbox, you're gonna you're gonna throw your uh, your shoulder pet off of you. So. I was tapping Y to try to grab that treasure map and it didn't work out. Because I threw my monkey. Look at all the pigs. This little piggy island. I really want to pair it too. There's so much stuff. I forgot how much early game uh, candy, little fun things there are to do. I call it candy. So there's just so much to do. I want to I wanna do it all. I know I said I wanted to progress quickly, which I do. But I want to tame a piggy army. I want to get a piggy army and go fight some pirates of the damned. I want to tame a bear. I want to tame a parrot. I want to tame everything. Because I'm basically I'm starting over. Obviously. And I had all that stuff. I guess I kind of took it for granted in my last playthrough. But if we grab these maps, wait for it to stop raining, and then we will head out. So, see you guys back in a sec. Alright guys, it has started and I have gathered a ton of pirate maps, or buried treasure maps, or whatever we're calling them. And uh, I think we're ready to go. I did get Henrietta, I felt bad, so I got her. She's right there. And then Tom, and uh, Monkey Bob here. So we got everybody. Snossage is going to guard the base. We'll probably be back. I, let me show you how many maps I got. Yeah, I got a lot of maps. So, we'll probably come back, because I'm sure some of them are on this island. I think I'm going to head, um, let's, let's see. Well, I don't really have anything unlocked, so I can't really head a specific direction. So let me see exactly where I'm going. Um, mm, I think we're going to head, I think we're going to head, um, southwest. No, southeast. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to head southeast. We're going to cross over, um, go through N and O, then to the other side of the map. It'll, it'll run us around to A, so that's where we're going to go. We're going to go over to the other side this time, because I haven't been there. We're not going to go too far this first uh, first trip. We're going to find an island, but that's where we're heading eventually, so we might as well start in that direction. Let's fully open this. Let's fully open that. And probably need to turn the sails. Okay. 
This is gonna be a pain. I miss my crew. Once you get crew, then you don't have to do all this mess. Hey, fish, what's going? All right, so now we're moving very slowly because we're way overweight. Turn that turtle way out here. But we should. Good gosh, we're going slow. Oh my goodness. What's our weight? Oh yeah, we're. Jeez. All right, let's let's chunk some stuff. Don't need that. Chunk that. Uh, gotta get rid of some weight. Gotta lose some weight. Chicken, I think this is your fault. Let's see what do we got here? I can lose half that crystal. I can lose half of that. Let's let's do. Uh, I need the wood. I need the thatch for repairs. Um, I'm not ready to get rid of the metal yet. We'll see how this goes first. Throw that off. How we doing? Why is none of it gone? Is it because it's still here? Do I have to take it up here? Get out of here. There, now that's gone. How we doing? Yeah, that's going down. All right. I guess it'll go away eventually and then the weight will dissipate, but let's go ahead and chunk it for good measure. Get out of here. All of you. I've, I've got berries. All right. We're moving a little bit better. How's our weight? Yeah, 1085 is better than we were. Alright, so... Which direction do we need to head? We're heading the opposite direction of where we want to go. It looks like the wind's going south, so that's good. Alright, so let's, let's go this way. We'll go around the island. We'll straighten her out. And hopefully we'll get a level pretty quick and we can increase our weight. So there's really two ways to main the sails. You can go and you can click in them and get the exact position you want, or you can just man them, which is just you just grab them and you spin them yourself. Which is what I kind of did. So they're not exactly the same, but we're moving in the right direction incredibly slowly. All right, so you see that XP bar, we're, we're going up, we'll level up here in just a sec. Which way are we going now? We're heading southeast. Let's head back this direction a little bit. Check our heading again. That's about right. We're doing what the wind wants to do. So you want to have the sails as lined up with the wind as you can. I try to line up that little uh, little line as close as I can parallel to the to the wind line. Is that a wreck up there? All right, finally. Please give me a decent amount of weight. A hundred. All right. Can already feel it going faster. So there is a wreck up here. We may check that out. <clears throat> But uh, do some sailing, and uh, I think that is going to do it for this episode, guys. I, uh, I appreciate you sticking with me. If you stuck till the end, make sure you hit that like button. Let me know. Uh, we've got our crew, our, our little midget crew. We don't want to make big guys, but uh, we're starting to grow a little beard here. That's pretty cool. We're getting a little scruffy, a little scruffy. 
But uh, guys, we're going to continue on this island or on this adventure uh, to find another island and uh, get continue to get going. We may even check out that pirate wreck on the next episode. I don't know. We'll see. I'm scared of sharks though, and I don't have a dive suit, so we might not. We'll see. We'll see. But guys, thanks so much for watching. If you uh, liked it, like like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. For those of you who are subscribed, thank you so much. Appreciate you watching. We will see you next time in Atlas. And this is Survival Bob saying, if you're going to be a Bob, have fun with it. What do you think, Monkey? Should we go get that? I'm kind of scared of it. I'm kind of scared. We'll just keep going. We'll look for treasure. We'll look for floats. And hopefully level up soon.